Our more recent history with Neanderthals has been that we've turned them into an other and something that was distant. But I want to bring them much closer and I hope the reader takes that point. In 2010, the Neanderthal genome was published. And what we found out is that people of European and Asian descent have between one and four percent Neanderthal DNA. So I realized, and I've since done a test to find out that I'm 2.5% Neanderthal, but a lot of modern humans have uh, Neanderthal DNA in them. And that's because we were able to interbreed and have viable offspring. Neanderthals were much closer to us than we previously imagined. And I wanted to write a book that brought the popular story closer to the science. I was writing a modern story and a 40,000 years ago story and I couldn't figure out how they were linked until I thought about my experience of being a mother and specifically of giving birth. It's something that connects me quite literally to my past so it became the through thread to connect the two stories. The Last Neanderthal. If you happen on one in the woods it would not be by accident. She would have sensed you coming long before felt curious about another upright primate and allowed you to approach. She would make a noise in the brush to let you know she was there. Maybe she would drop her spear to show you that she didn't mean harm. She would spread the fingers of her left hand and raise that palm to greet you. <laughs>